Good morning, Shem Bulldogs. I'm David Upgrade. I'm back with your Shem Sinner News. Today is Monday, February 27th, and let's start things off with the weather today. How's the weather, Hayden? Today we have temperatures ranging from 45 to 60 degrees Fahrenheit, with rain in the afternoon. Back to you, David. Thanks, Hayden. Shamby boys and girls varsity soccer will play the next game today at North Cap Stadium against Dunwoody. The, the girls will play at 5.30 and the boys play after at 7.30. Speaking of rivalry games, Shambly girls tennis will play their next match today against Maris here at Shambly. Shambly baseball will play an away game today at Burkmar at 5.30. And Shambly track and field will have their, their next match against Pius on Wednesday. Good luck to our Shambly sports teams and go Bulldogs. Now we're going to take a short commercial break. Eddie Van Halen, a renowned guitarist, knows how important it is to keep music education in our schools. Van Halen wants to guarantee all children have the opportunities to practice music because music proved to be an important factor in the development of his own life and career. Due to budget cuts, schools are forced to cut non-essential programs like music. However, this cut causes drastic damage to children because studies show that kids who play instruments get better grades, have higher IQs, and lower chances of drug and alcohol abuse later in life. Van Halen and Felice Mancini of Mr. Holland's Opus Foundation recently revealed Van Halen's big donation in a recent interview. 75 of Eddie Van Halen's guitars from his personal collection were given to Mr. Holland's Opus Foundation to distribute to low-income public schools. The gift ensures that children receiving this, the generous donation by the rock legend will be given the chance to shred while promoting the arts. This is a truly inspirational story of how the rock legend Eddie Van Halen is helping bring music back to schools one guitar at a time. Thank you for watching. Finally, we have your quote of the day. The cost of liberty is less than the price of repression by W.E. Du Bois. That's all for today, Bulldogs. Enjoy the rest of your day, and we'll see you back here tomorrow.